Hi Matt, my name is Seth Demore, and I asked for a business card from you last week and you mow a couple lawns uh, next door to me. To all the veteran viewers of the VLOG, and frankly at this point, friends, let's just call a spade a spade. Question of the day, how much do I enjoy my yard? If you've, if you've been on this journey for 860 plus vlogs, the lawn and lawn care has been kind of a big part of my story and my communication of my story to all of you. Second question of the day, what was my first job? Who knows? I have been mowing lawns since I was 12 years old. 12. It's coming to an end. Mowing my lawn is coming to an end. And it blows my mind. But after a lot of discernment, a lot of discussion with true love, we've decided that it's time to hand the reins over, not to Joseph James, he's only five years old. I thought I could hold out till he was 10 and I was gonna pass the task off to him, but that's five years away. I cannot run, I cannot vlog, I cannot <laughs> be as present as I would like to be to my family if I have to put three to four hours a week into taking care of this yard. And so we decided together that it's time. It's time to hire a company to come to our house once a week to do a task that I can do. However, <laughs> I don't have the time to do it well anymore. Rather, I want to do better at taking care of others instead of the lawn every week. So that three to four hours, yeah, it's gonna go toward taking the boys on bike rides. It's gonna go toward it, you know taking the drone up maybe a couple couple more times a week for you guys it's going to open up a little bit of mental relief so that I can focus on other things. But I'm telling you right now, I wrestled with this question for a long time. <laughs> and it, it kind of breaks my heart a little bit. It breaks my heart that I can't, and I'm exaggerating to a certain extent, but like my grandfather was mowing his yard. Now he was retired, but he mowed his yard up until his, I believe his 80s. I mean, we're talking about a, a tough bird. Like, he, you know, he went for it. But I know now is the time to hand the baton off. Okay, always try and look at life half with a glass half full. That's my mentality. And at least somebody else is going to be able to make a little extra money every week by coming with their expertise and their proper tools and knock it out in probably 25 minutes because they have the riding lawnmower. And so yes, the title of this vlog is not an exaggeration. My heart's a little broken because when I started mowing lawns when I was 12, it opened up avenues and money and the opportunity to put money in the bank and the opportunity to buy stuff and the opportunity to travel or buy a season pass for snowboarding. So I have this like connection to lawn mowing that is probably a little deeper than yours, but just know that Sometimes in life, you gotta know when to ask for help. And at this point, I need help. And so that is that. I'm excited, a little sad, but more excited. And I think I'll be really excited on Tuesday when Matt shows up 
with his riding lawnmower and knocks it out in 25 minutes and I can be inside wrestling with the boys or reading a book or editing the vlog. Just call, call it what it is. <sighs> Seek beauty. Work hard. Work hard. But no one to ask for help. <laughs>